the action took place on this very porch here. Now usually during speeches, Warren would stand in the middle here on the steps, the top step, Florence right beside him. And they would wave to the crowds who were parading down Mount Vernon Avenue toward his house. But this was a perfect backdrop for the campaign. Not only did it show the human side of the Hardings, the fact that they did not live in a mansion. They lived in a very normal house, most like most of the folks coming to see him speak. They wanted to feature this town as well. Warren himself often said that this campaign was taking Main Street to the White House. And Florence was very much a part of this message. She was a very visible part of this campaign. She was always near him on the front porch when he was speaking. She gave interviews herself to magazines, especially women's magazines. She alternated between being the savvy politician to being the homebody, the wife, the caretaker of the candidate. So she knew how politics worked. She knew the different sides of her that would have to be portrayed as part of this campaign in order to make his campaign successful for him. She is not afraid to wade into a crowd. She's not hanging back. And she is in the line shaking hands along with the president-to-be. And going through hundreds, if not thousands, of people standing there as long as it'll take to shake the hands and greet people. So we see a Florence Harding who knows how her husband is going to get to the White House through the votes. It's very important politically, but she absolutely believes in the people of the United States.